In 1977, humanity embarked on one of its most ambitious adventures. We sent two remarkable spacecraft, Voyager 1 and Voyager 2, on a journey into the vast unknown, beyond the familiar boundaries of our solar system. These twin probes were launched from Earth, their rockets blazing into the sky, carrying with them the hopes and dreams of an entire generation. These weren't just machines, they were our distant explorers, our curiosity made real, sent to unveil the secrets of the outer planets. Each instrument, each camera, was carefully designed to capture the wonders of worlds we had never seen up close. As they soared through space, they became our eyes and ears, relaying back breathtaking images and invaluable data. But their cargo was more than scientific equipment. They carried the Golden Record, a time capsule filled with Earth's sounds, images and greetings in 55 languages. This golden disc was a message to the cosmos, a greeting from our small blue planet to any who might find it, containing music, laughter and the heartbeat of humanity itself. It was a leap of hope, a message set adrift in the cosmic sea, uncertain if it would ever find a recipient. The golden record was our way of saying, we were here, we reached out. It was a bold gesture, a testament to our desire to connect even across unimaginable distances. The mission was made possible by a rare planetary alignment, a cosmic coincidence that occurs only once every 176 years. This alignment allowed the Voyagers to leap from world to world using gravity's pull, a grand tour that let them visit multiple planets in a single journey, slingshotting from one giant to the next. Their path took them past Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune, peeling back the mysteries of our solar neighborhood. Each flyby revealed new wonders, swirling storms on Jupiter, the icy rings of Saturn, the blue-green hues of Uranus, and the windswept clouds of Neptune. Two small ambassadors launched into the endless dark, destined to travel farther than anything humanity had ever created. Against the backdrop of the infinite, they became tiny beacons of human ingenuity and hope, venturing where no one had gone before. Their odyssey would transform our understanding of the solar system, and our place within it. The data they sent home, rewrote textbooks, inspired generations of scientists, and deepened our sense of wonder about the universe. They became icons of our unyielding drive to explore and connect with the universe. The Voyagers remind us that curiosity is a powerful force, pushing us to cross new frontiers and seek answers to the biggest questions. The Voyager story is our story, reaching out, hoping for a reply from the silent depths of space. Each faint signal they send is a reminder of our longing to be heard, to know that we are not alone in the cosmos. It's a tale of discovery, awe, and a final astonishing message from the edge of what we thought we knew. As they crossed into interstellar space, the Voyagers became the first human-made objects to leave the solar system, venturing into the true unknown. These spacecraft are our cosmic message in a bottle, set adrift in the endless sea of stars. They carry with them the story of Earth, a record of who we are and what we value, floating silently through the void. They remind us that exploration is not just a scientific pursuit, but a deeply human one. The Voyager mission is a testament to our creativity, our teamwork, and our relentless desire to understand the universe around us. Voyager's voyage stands as a symbol of hope, curiosity, and the timeless urge to reach beyond our world. It is a story of daring, of looking up at the night sky and wondering what lies beyond, and then finding the courage to go and see for ourselves. As they departed Earth, they carry not only data, but the dreams of an entire planet. Every person who ever looked up at the stars is part of their journey, woven into the fabric of their mission. And now, in the quiet of interstellar space, they wait, hoping that, one day, someone or something will hear our call. The Voyagers continue their silent journey, carrying our message ever onward, a testament to the enduring spirit of exploration that defines us all. On Pillars of Fire, Voyager 2 launched in August 1977, followed by Voyager 1. Scientists watched, knowing these probes would outlive their creators. Their paths were calculated to use gravity assists a cosmic express lane to the outer planets. Each planet gave a push, redirecting the spacecraft toward the next target. This elegant dance made the grand tour possible on a human time scale. The Voyagers cruised past Mars, through the asteroid belt, and emerged unscathed, their first major destination, Jupiter. As they traveled, they sent back data through the deep space network, measuring solar wind, magnetic fields, and cosmic rays. Even the space between worlds was full of discovery. The Voyagers weren't just tourists, they were pioneers, mapping the unseen forces of our cosmic neighborhood. 
Every mile brought new knowledge and new anticipation. Voyager 1's arrival at Jupiter in 1979 transformed our view of the planet. The Great Red Spot became a titanic hurricane and faint rings were discovered. Unexpected wonders, Jupiter's moons stunned us, Io a volcanic world, Europa with hints of a subsurface ocean. The search for life gained a new target. Saturn's rings revealed in detail were thousands of icy ringlets shaped by tiny shepherd moons. Titan's thick atmosphere hinted at hidden mysteries. Voyager 2 continued to Uranus and Neptune discovering tipped axes, dark rings and Triton's nitrogen geysers. Each flyby rewrote textbooks turning distant dots into dynamic worlds. The Voyagers didn't just visit planets, they revolutionized planetary science. After their historic flybys of Neptune, the Voyager spacecraft embarked on a bold new mission, one that would take them far beyond the familiar planets, toward the very edge of the Sun's influence in our solar system. Their journey was no longer just about exploring planets, but about venturing into the unknown. The heliosphere, a vast invisible magnetic bubble carved out by the solar wind, became their next great frontier. This bubble, created by charged particles streaming from the sun, shields our solar system from the harshness of interstellar space. The first major boundary they encountered was the termination shock, where the solar wind suddenly slows down and becomes turbulent. Voyager 1 crossed this invisible line in 2004, followed by Voyager 2 in 2007, marking a significant milestone in their journey. Beyond the termination shock, lay the Helioshi, a chaotic and turbulent region where the solar wind collides with the interstellar medium. Here, the environment grew stranger, and the boundaries between our solar system and the galaxy beyond began to blur. For years, the probes pressed onward through this mysterious territory, their signals growing ever fainter as the distance to Earth increased. Each transmission became a precious link to these distant explorers. At last they approached the final boundary, the heliopause. This is where the sun's influence truly ends, and the vast, uncharted realm of interstellar space begins. Crossing the heliopause would mean leaving the solar system behind, a monumental and historic moment in human exploration never before achieved. Back on Earth scientists watched every faint signal with anticipation and hope, knowing the spacecraft were aging and that every bit of data they sent was invaluable for understanding our place in the cosmos. The anticipation grew, what mysteries and wonders might lie beyond the sun's reach in the vast darkness between the stars. The voyagers pressed on, bravely charting the very edge of the known solar system, mapping a path for future explorers to follow. The final crossing into interstellar space would change everything, opening a new chapter in humanity's quest to explore the universe. As the voyagers neared the heliopause anxiety grew, would cosmic rays destroy the probes at the threshold of discovery? The interstellar medium was a mystery, could it be more hostile than we imagined? The silence beyond might not be empty but violent, the greatest fear, the unknown itself. The team waited, listening for a whisper from the void. In August 2012, something remarkable happened. Voyager 1's data suddenly changed, solar particles dropped dramatically, while cosmic rays spiked to unprecedented levels. This shift was the first clear sign that the probe was leaving the familiar environment of our solar system behind, it had crossed the heliopause, the invisible boundary where the sun's influence ends, and entered the vast uncharted territory of interstellar space. Despite the immense distance, the probe kept transmitting, sending back precious data from the space between stars, information no human-made object had ever collected before. Years passed in silence and darkness. By July 2025, the voyagers were nearly silent, their power reserves dwindling, their instruments growing cold and still. Then against all odds, a final, structured data packet arrived from Voyager 1, a last whisper from the edge of the unknown. This wasn't just a collection of measurements, it was a map, a detailed chart of something never seen before. Voyager had detected vast filamentary structures of dark matter, invisible threads connecting our solar system to nearby stars, weaving a hidden framework through the galaxy. These filaments act as cosmic highways, channeling particles and energy between star systems, shaping the flow of matter and information across the cosmos. Our solar system is not alone, it is part of a local network, a cosmic web that binds us to the greater galaxy. The interstellar wind, a river of charged particles, flows along these threads, 
carrying the story of distant stars. We are not isolated, we are connected to our stellar neighbors by these invisible bridges, part of a vast, interconnected community. The heliosphere, once thought to be a lonely bubble, is actually a glowing node in a galactic network, a vital point in the cosmic web. Voyager's final message was not an ending, but a new beginning, a revelation that our place in the universe is more connected and more wondrous than we ever imagined. This discovery changes everything. The space between stars is not empty, it has structure, a cosmic web linking star systems. These dark matter filaments may explain how galaxies hold together and how stars are born. Material, and perhaps life's building blocks, could travel along these pathways. The implications for science and our identity are profound. We are not an island, but part of a grand interconnected structure. This new map could guide future interstellar travel. Voyager's final act gave us a destination and a roadmap. The dream of reaching other worlds is now a challenge to be solved. Voyager has pointed the way forward. The Voyagers are silent now, drifting through the Milky Way with their golden records. Their mission is over but their legacy is just beginning. They revealed our solar system's wonders and our connection to the cosmos. The universe is not empty, but a single interconnected whole. We stand at a new threshold with a new map in hand. Voyager's journey reminds us what we can achieve through curiosity and unity. The adventure continues, new telescopes, new probes, new dreams. The cosmic web awaits with more secrets to uncover. Our journey into the cosmos is just beginning. The universe is not just to be observed, it is something we are part of.